Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu gave an ultimatum to Hamas and vowed to continue the war until the Palestinian group is eliminated entirely and Gaza poses no threat to Israel. Jean Domingo reports. Surrender or die. This is the option given by Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu and reiterated Israel's long-standing position on the war that the fighting would not stop at all unless Hamas was completely destroyed and hostages were freed. Netanyahu's words come after Hamas reportedly rejected Israel's offer for another seven-day humanitarian pause in exchange for freeing 40 Israeli hostages. Citing anonymous sources, the Wall Street Journal reported that Israel had offered to halt its military operations for a week in exchange for the release of hostages and allow more humanitarian aid into Gaza. However, Hamas and the Palestinian Islamic Jihad reportedly told the Egyptian mediators that Israel must halt its offensive in the Gaza Strip before they will talk about any potential deal. The report also said that Islamic Jihad demanded Israel to free all Palestinian prisoners for the release of all remaining hostages, which is estimated at around 100. Meanwhile, it is believed that there are thousands of Palestinians in Israeli jails. More than 120 hostages are believed to remain in Gaza after Israel and Hamas held its week-long truce, which eventually collapsed with both Israel and Hamas blaming each other for its fall. Reporting this has been Jane Domingo, SMNI News.